Well, like you said, we have 21 candidates hoping to become the next mayor of the city of Chicago. And that means come February, come election day, you're going to probably see 21 names on your ballot. But there's a whole rule here. So in order to become part of that ballot, you have to have at least 12,500 signatures. And some candidates came to cut it very close when it came down to yesterday's final days. For example, tech, tech entrepreneur Neil Sales Griffin came up with 18,000 signatures. Comptroller Susana Mendoza and Cook County Circuit Court Clerk Dorothy Brown had 25,000. And Southwest Side attorney Jerry Joyce had about 30,000 signatures. So what's next here? Candidates can now challenge each other and eliminate others out of the race. Many have said that they will have to play it by ear on whether or not they will challenge a candidate. But Mendoza made it clear, and she said that's not her intention to do so. Now, the last time Chicago saw this many candidates was in 2011, when Mayor Daley announced he was retiring. 20 candidates filed, only six ended up on the ballot. And really, that's what makes it a tough call here. So right now we have, like I said, 21 candidates on the ballot. But come election week, come election day, that number might change. We might lose some candidates. We'll, of course, stay on top of that story and bring you the latest.